Uh, this smart peg is made out of a soft aluminum material. It has a, a zinc coated magnet on the top of it. This is a delicate measuring device. And I can tell you when we moved from the previous Sostel uh, measurement into the, the, the ISQ and now the IDX series, and we've started using these smart pegs, the first thing you think about as a clinician is can I reuse them? You know, can I sterilize them? Can I cold sterilize them? Um, and, and I thought the same darn thing. I thought, man, if I can use these multiple times, that's going to reduce the cost quite a bit. The problem with it is these things oxidize quickly, and because it's a soft aluminum, um, and once you place these and remove these multiple times, even if you found a way to cold sterilize them, you're damaging that connection, and that's going to influence your ISQ readings. Okay, so it is single patient use, and what that means is if, if I have one patient replacing multiple implants on, we'll be using that throughout that patient. Now, I know some clinicians that try to hold on to it and use it later on that patient, but it is not, it is not designed to go through a sterilization process, okay, and, and, and that's an important thing. This is, this is your actual measurement device. This is the key principle in getting accurate ISQ readings.